Recent data show that Korea's trade surplus with the U.S. is actually shrinking. President Trump has repeatedly claimed that the U.S. is on the losing end of the FTA, so this could work to Korea's advantage if the deal goes back to the negotiating table. Our Kim ji explains. During the bilateral summit between Korea and the United States, President Donald Trump signaled a renegotiation of the free trade agreement between the two countries, signing an imbalance in trade. Our trade deficit with South Korea has increased by more than $11 billion. Not exactly a great deal. President Trump claims Korea is enjoying a surplus of around $20 billion a year from its trade with the U.S. However, data shows Korea's trade surplus with the U.S. has actually waned. Data from the Korea International Trade Association shows trade surplus during the first five months of this year through May amounted to nearly 6.9 billion U.S. dollars, down by $4.1 billion from the same period last year. This is mainly due to tougher U.S. regulations, including anti-dumping measures imposed on Korean automobile and steel exports to the country. Korea needs to actively take part in the renegotiation process if it comes to that in emphasizing that the U.S. is not on the losing end of the deal. Korea's annual surplus from its trade with the U.S. amounted to $23.2 billion last year. Kim Jian, Arirang News.